Hey peeps, what's up? Munchy here, back with another video and we have a new build of Pixel Experience. This of course is the official stable build based on Android 12 available for the POCO F1. Those of you who want to know how to install this build, have a look at the features of previous build. Videos for those can be found in the description of this video. Now in this specific build, the first change you will notice is that security patch is from February 2022. The kernel they are using is Edude kernel. Build is from February 28th. Next up you can go in to settings security and bam here it is once you have set up a pin you should have the option of setting up your face and fingerprint unlock yes ir face unlock has been implemented by the developers over at pixel experience and it works like a boss on the poco f1 so now that we have addressed the elephant in the room that is the only major change in this specific build. Then we can head over to our Play Store and do the other checks which we normally do. So as you can see, Play Protect certification device is certified. This means your banking apps are going to work without any issues. With respect to your YouTube media playback, everything works absolutely fine. Live caption works, picture in picture works. Of course, for picture in picture to work, either you need to have YouTube premium or you need to be in a specific country in case you do not want to pay for YouTube premium. And with respect to your live translate, that unfortunately does not work with YouTube as of now. Moving over to Google Photos, backing up from this pixel is free and unlimited in original quality eps that is something which comes with pixel experience and if i try to edit a picture of my favorite football star wait for this loading bar to finish go into tools portrait light bam here it is portrait light in the building working without any issues do note that portrait light is not going to work on objects it only works on humans and unfortunately you do not have the feature of magic eraser on this specific build with respect to the assistant lady she is there and she works with the screen turned on and with the screen turned off as well next up we can have a look at the app opening animations so here are the app opening animations on your screen right now and as you can see app opening animations are pretty good no jitters no lags recents nopes i am trying to switch between a few applications that also works without any issues then we can have a look at the recents these are also pretty smooth select works without any issues screenshot also works like a pause with respect to your google feed here it is once the content has cached google feed is pretty smooth transition from the google feed to your home screen is also pretty smooth as well so what is the final take on this latest february build of pixel experience for the poco f1 well the build is definitely smooth but i would still have appreciated if we got some pixel 6 exclusive features because this right now is the pixel 5 experience but but I am super happy about face unlock working like a boss.